Hi, I'm Jason, a technician with Cincinnati Bell. The purpose of this support video is to show you how to reset your wireless network name and password. There are a couple different reasons why you may need to do this. One reason is to create your own network name instead of using the default name on the gateway. The other reason is if you want to change your network name and password because someone has accessed your network without your consent. In either scenario, follow the steps in this video to guide you through the process. Before we begin, please note that proceeding will require you to reconnect all your devices. First, open your browser and type in the address you see here, then hit enter. This will open a login screen for the Zyzel Gateway user interface. For this example, we are using the Zyzel 3415 Gateway, which requires a specific login and can be found on the back of the gateway. Locate the administrator username and password. You will use this to log in. The first screen you will see is called Connection Status. This is going to show you all the devices that are connected to your gateway. It's important to note that many other settings can be changed using this interface. Please, only follow the steps to reset your name and password. Let's continue. Scroll to the bottom of the page and hover over Network Setting. Then scroll up to Wireless and select it. Here you will see your Wi-Fi network name and password listed as well as the action button on the right to edit. For this customer's example, we will change the network's name and password from what you see here. Scroll over to the edit button and select it. Now you'll see a screen showing you Wi-Fi network settings. Scroll to the Wi-Fi network name field. Delete the current name and type in the new name you want to use. Then, do the same for the password. Type in the password you would like to use. Click the Save button. Your Wi-Fi network name and password has been changed. It is very important to note that since you've made these changes, all your connected devices must be reconnected to your network using this new name and password. If you need assistance on how to connect your devices, here's a link to that video. Thanks for watching. I hope this video was helpful. For more support, please visit our Help Center or YouTube channel.